Where's the glory? It's filling up this house. I want her to steps coming. Here's what's going to happen. As a walker. As she walks. Coming forward. The from her ankles to her knees. To her waist. Up until she drowns. I don't know when and how it will happen. But when she comes to the front. She will see who she is. Start your journey. Coming forward. Stand right there. So tell me, niggas, and your microphone, I patel. Let her carry the microphone herself. Uncle, uncle. God. I told you that this is a port. Who represent our fundis? He will rep- she will represent the pastors. But not only at Mount Zion Carnation, but the church is going to give his servants a new strength, a new anointing to work in this new era. What you will see being released unto him is going to be released on all the anointing Africa, on Africa and in the whole world. Because the time that we're in it's a different kind of thing. We can't do things the old way but we're going to do things in a new manner. And even the spirits that have been released from hell, and the diseases that have been released from hell, and in it's not it's the same as the one that we used to. The spirits that we're going to have are not the same as the ones that we used to. We're not going to do things the same way. We're not going to do things the same way. Everything, Everything is different. Heavenly Father, release that fresh anointing. That works in this new era. We know that when you do something new, even the devil does something new. He's always watching what you're doing. And then he imitates it. On top of all your anointing, release the new things. Release your new anointing. Release something new from your wisdom. Release something new from your gifts on the spirit. Release something new from the power. Release something new from the light. Release something new. Release something new of your fresh oil. When we speak about the new era, we speak about something like this. What has God done that the devil doesn't imitate? Even as there's a new era, the devil is still imitating the old ways. There's already new diseases that the devil is releasing. You keep up giving up your wish. Releasing new kinds of crime. All the things that he's releasing is new. So why it's not singing as guazu guazu is in to go to the things that God has given us. Yes. Criminals use different ways they are not. Even sorcerers use new manners of doing things. I'll show you in the weeks to come. Because you need to know so that when God does a new thing, the devil comes with something new as well. Thank 
It works. You can't be in his house and nothing happens to him. You cannot. Can you believe what's happening? Do you receive that it's happening to you? Do you receive it? Do you receive it? Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. God has released a great revival. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Because it's another phase. Because it's another phase. He is the devil wants to discourage him. the of God. They were the ones who were targeted during this time. God has released a great He's released a great power. Great, a new fresh and he's released glory. Thank you, Jesus. 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 Ira ba ika dosa brazile meye ila ba 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 shikraya kabru brazende rimreze lebriandro shetele bekete zaki anamuya ila ba ba ila brazende so go go kalo Elijah Elijah once cried out what he says excelle no o says excelle says 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 excelle ngeto what you gulu gulu na seven thousand. And the Lord said, "There are seven thousand. Yeah, you, you know when you think you're alone. Seven thousand percent. Seven thousand percent. You. Seven thousand percent. Seven thousand percent. Aye, no, Banning, Bacon. There are many God is still alive. He's still raising them up. No matter how he is raising them up, they are being raised up. He's still doing that even now. Amen. Amen. 
is he doing? He's still doing it now. Why? Because Because he is God. There's nothing that defeats him. Not a single thing. Just be patient with me for a little while. You are being marinated. You are being marinated. I want you to leave with this thing. Pastor. Stand up. Helabai dan soko jum. Leini hirada harutus. Pagamam fundise. Stand up, my pastor. Galumne is the microphone I patel. Best we are session now, I got it. Tell me, when's the Tell me what happened. Don't tell me. Hello, Pendo, Spare Pamber. I was cutting you so also, I'm going to say, listen, also in your side. I'm going to start singing the song of the Pemo of Angiza La Pambi. When it's moving from the back to the front, I was like I was walking through a tunnel. It was so dark. It was very dark. When I was walking, it wasn't a very pleasant place for me to be in. There was so much light at the end. As I was walking, my eyes were looking at the light that I was going toward. Because for the past three days, I was very hopeless, but I didn't know where it came from. I was trying to look. There was nothing that upset me. And there was no situation that could have provoked me. But I just felt hopeless. I can give up the calling. I felt like giving up the calling. But not knowing. I even told you, Dad, that I don't know. God, I'm so down. But I feel very down. And I feel like I'm ready to die here. And this is what I'm saying. So, so, as I was walking from the back, the light was calling me. And as I reached the bottom of the stairs, and I got to the stairs, I saw I was in a new, new world. I was in a new world. I was in this new world. And I was standing under an open heaven. And I could see what was happening in heaven while I was on earth. I could see the angels going up and down. Before the throne. And I was confused how I could see this because it was like I was seeing it with my eyes. Now it was like the light was following me, no longer I following the light. And when I got to the top of the stage, I couldn't see where I was coming from. 
And I couldn't see my yesterday. And I couldn't see the tunnel that I came from. Even couldn't see where I lost my hope. But I felt new hope. And I felt new strength. And I felt joy. This is my calling. To say that this is my calling. This is who I am. This is who I am. And I asked myself, why did this have to happen? Then the Holy Spirit explained to me that the Spirit was being taken out of me. And the Spirit was meant to defeat all the servants of God and close all the churches. But Jesus said he's giving all of his servants a new hope. Because it was very difficult. But I see the servants of God rising up. And I saw that there was a globe in front of me. And it was going to touch all the countries. And Jesus said that he's connecting his church all over the world. He's connecting his church. But it's time now about they will cry. But they are together because they but are the body of Christ. He wants his body to be united. He is making us one as so a body of Christ, not as a Mount Zion Incarnation Ministry. But I saw us as a Mount Zion Incarnation Ministry bringing this connection to all the pastors and all the churches come together where we are and we became one. I'm seeing angels with my naked eye. I can see that I'm not seeing with my spiritual eye, but with my natural eye. And Jesus said, This is the time. This is the new era where they will see me with your physical eye, not just your spiritual eye. And you see angels. But when, not just with a, a physical eye, the spiritual I mean. But we will see with our natural eyes. Isn't this is where you're born? The things that we will see. We will see them happening physically. Then I saw this light. It was surrounding me wherever I go. I see doors. I saw myself standing a long time. Before this door, and it would not open. And this door would not open. When I look at the time, and my watch, I see the time on my right hand. It does not align. I see the earthly time saying one thing. And the watch that is on this door saying a different time. 
God, I would miss and get with him. But then I hear a voice in my ear. Let's see, beg his cards. Saying, look at the time. Then I remember to my because it was exactly last year when Mama took you wash on Fagalais and Sam. And I remember it was exactly last year that Mom took a watch and put it on my wrist. It was exactly this time. It was exactly this time. And I, and I saw it beginning to spin to align with the watch on the door. <laughs> I see the physical time saying the same time that's on the door. Jesus said, this is the time. He said, he's aligning the time. Jesus said, he's aligning the time. Nothing has been delayed. Nothing has come too soon, but everything is aligned. Everything that happened was supposed to happen now. <laughs> and I saw myself <laughs> being the same. I see my spiritual self being the same as the natural self. Because sometimes, Baba. Because sometimes. I struggle in my self to be the same as the spiritual self that I see. Sometimes I will try and try. Sometimes Zozama. I find myself stumbling and falling. With anger in my heart. But when I see the spiritual self is perfect, she has love in her heart. She doesn't get defeated, she's passionate. But when I look at myself, I get defeated and I get tired. And I'm quick-tempered. Alignment between my spiritual life and my physical life. What I've been longing for spiritually. I've been changed, I've been an alignment between my spiritual self and my natural self. What I've been longing for for a long time. Aligning our spiritual life and our physical life, what we've been longing for. Oh, Jesus, we're going to dance. 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 We're I look at myself, Dad. And I see myself in myself. And I see us the same. And I see the speed that I'm moving with. Spiritually. Spiritually. And I see myself even physically because moving. Because sometimes I will have ideas. And the wound will blame me as you are not trying. And people will blame me and say, I'm not me. Pursuing your dreams. But they don't know what's in my heart. I want to do it. I want to make it work. I want to pursue my ideas now. I want to pursue my ideas and dreams. But I'll get stuck and I'll give up. But I'll find myself trying and I'll get stuck and I'll give up. I've been doing the very same thing for years and years and years. Speak great ideas and what about the vision board when it's come to implementation, I will fail. I couldn't implement I'm now, Bob. I can't even count how many dreams I have. But I see the speed that which I'm thinking of moving. But it doesn't align with the speed that I'm working with. <laughs> To implement, things. to implement things. To implement things. Go and implement whatever that you were dreaming, you were seeing in your vision. Jesus is saying that. Go implement.
meant it because he's now giving it. us the ability to do <laughs> it. I see him looking at me in the eye, pointing me with his giant finger. <laughs> you can do it. It's when you go as you go in. I feel that hope and is in him. Sing Giza Lelo Tembe is in him. I can do it. That Ninga Quenza. I don't have to worry. Ugu Singiza Mili Zolo. I don't have to worry that I tried yesterday. Nga Sulego Quenza. And I failed. But I must hold on to the word of today that Jesus said the words of Gwenza. And what he said, he will do it. Yesterday's words are now a testimony. There's something that you said that when you said don't forget your yesterday because it is your testimony. Jesus is saying the words that he spoke many years ago will be a testimony today that his word does not come back for it. He's giving us a testimony. He's giving us a testimony. That we will say the same testimony that Jesus is faithful. Because we'll see his faithfulness in this time. In other words, this is a part of heaven. Either it's an airport, it's a harbor, whether it's an airport or it's a bus station. No, me say bus station. God and Jay. I'm going to say, who born in Gelosi physical? You heard she saw angels physically. Agna Matlug. With no difference. Yellow is a color lam is only some seven. And Sama was a zone in a very good he saw, she saw a heavenly being and the earthly person that is her. And they were both aligned and they became one. Do you hear this? Amen. So how do you feel right now? I feel a brand new person, love. Not the person that I was when I arrived this morning. I was very down. Not knowing what was causing to me to me to be so down. I could hear you preach. But I couldn't see you. I went to go fetch my glasses. Because our, our vision is blurry. But now a mask and glasses so makes it steamy. So I ended up opening Facebook. So I tried to open Facebook on my phone. Because you are too far for me to see. And I couldn't even hear what you were preaching. I could hear you from far. But it didn't make sense to me. But now... I feel aligned with everything that you said. And it sounds and makes sense in my mind. I don't know how. I see my vision clearing. That if I was at the back and couldn't see at the front. But now that I'm at the front, I can see at the back. So, yeah, now I can see clearly. I can see everyone. Yeah. Okay. <clears throat> Before Zval, I want to demonstrate. Before we close, I'd like to demonstrate. Oh. Before, before I continue, I'd like to emphasize. All pastors, the most of pastors, no man, it's all the pastors, they all were very pastors, discouraged. They are very discouraged. So, they are 
She was going to represent all of them. They have resigned and closed churches. Others have left the church. They said they're going to work. This thing of Jesus is over. And they thought that it was not going to work. And they returned cars and sold them. And said they can't even pay these and things over. And they terminated their leases. And they said this thing of Jesus is not real. So now we're just going to work. We're going to be... So what you say, if you revive all these Jesus leaders, said, I want to revive all of these people. What locals are going to again, locals are going to go to Bani and get the locals are going to go and get born. He said, "What's happening to her will happen to others in the way that it's meant to happen to them." But it wasn't an easy time. It was a very difficult 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 time. But because Jesus has done what he's done, a port. Amen. Amen. It is now done. Job is in Fuselelo. A vision is a connection. 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 And they, I said, being mean, like, no, not me. Gang is and giving them a Philistines of a word. I will not die with the Philistines. They will die. My vision will come back to me. But my vision will come back. Amen. Uban lensi zole se la papan. What is your name, young man? Wakala zangi shole se tu zawa. Oh, niazi kamala kake. Masakala. Ngi aku meno munti skate se tia ngake tu zawa kunga zno tu ban. Maseng buzu yaz ngi abuzana mena ngi abuzana all the time. Okay. Okay. So busy as a Benz, I saw it. I'm working here in the church. Thank you. Thank you that you listen. My son, Sazi, can you stand up? My son, can you stand up? 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 Again, 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 again. Now, I want to tell you seven days ago, they're going to get it on the microphone. I'm so proud of my script, Allah. Praise the Lord. I'm going to walk here. Who's the one that pumped, right? I want you to walk forward. I'm going to tell you my son, it's him. I'll tell you when. Because. People have disrespected the pulpit. The pulpit represents all the pulpits through which Jesus speaks. Why did she say she went through a tunnel to come here? You will always see the light here. It doesn't matter how you speak about the pastor. But Jesus uses this place. In the weakness and even in the power of the pastor. Jesus reveals his strength. That's why you saw it going through a tunnel coming into the light. As I'm calling this young man, man, when he comes here, what happened to him? It's going to it's stay in the way. way. When, when he, he gets here, he will tell us what was happening. Come.
What's happening? I shake. Huh? I get shake. I get shake. You? Call in. When did that start? January. Huh? Which January? In January. January. When's that January? Were you doing this? I was good in. You don't know what it is. Okay, why act the hotel? Have you been to the doctor? Mm. Yes. What's in? What did they say? Tell one loot. Huh? Tell one loot. They say they can't see anything. Tell him what you see in him. It's like he's on Tell us what you see. 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 what I 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 Coming to the front. His wife had locks and chains all over him. Like when a giant is being bound. So he was bound from his head to his toes. But when I look at him, why like the he's bound and the past at the same time i see him every intercession i see him in intercession praying when he prays people were touched and when they were touched they send these men there are two men to come and chain him up and hold him with these chains so that he could never see him again and I see these chains binding. But when I see what they're supposed to do to him, he was supposed to go insane. Becoming an insane person. That goes and prays and speaks in tongue on the road. But his mind has left him. So as we were walking from the back, to the I see these chains that he's going with. And the people that bound him are amazed at how he's walking because he was so But when he got to the front, I keep seeing that light again. I see the chains being behind and him alone was the one who was ascending coming to the front. And he was at the front. I see him here. And I see his mind next to to him, but not within him. What do you think he should do? I think that when his mind comes back to him, there'll be a memory about what happened before he felt the way he's feeling. Then he'll be okay. Then bring his mind back. <laughs> Please instruct me, Dad. Please give me an instruction. This time you'll do it yourself. The answer is in the same way today. Hmm. About words, Dad? Yes. Okay. Yeah. Yes. 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 Then Babangalis Catsilo and Gikuluma Mazui, as I speak these words, Dad, Gibonum Gondo, I came in good heart. I see it, my his mind's are taken. Clan your pants, Umkondo, a hamper, water, a buile, a candle. The insanity stays on the side, and his mind goes back into his body. Umbiz, Utaga, I guess. 
call him and tell him to come. Sazi was Sazi come. Oh, one more good evangel. Shalom. 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 How are you feeling? I'm good, Dad. Are you sure? You came here shaking. Something like a stroke we and say. It was like a stroke was happening. Tell us what it happened and Tell us how it happened and how it started. My grandmother passed away on December twenty-five. So we were praying with her. again. And she passed away. And then I call her depression to show need. Then I was depressed that she passed away. And then I'm young girl. Then it started me. And then Miss Ungona had singing Sapind and Sumayele. And I was singing Gay. Thought I was alone, I'll never be. If only I'm coming go so go give for Nella one double hundreds, but in take Kubanale seem what to lega. Gong at singing Gay. I felt very alone. Got soon when she came here. It was very painful. Being it in a gay and Sumayele. And I thought I'd stop preaching. Gay and I stopped. What a munch. But now, Gabriel. I'm going back. Come on, Mount Zion Carnation. Satan, you know, man. Now, man, you Satan, you know, man. Got a new C volume, my microphone, guys. And got a shallow lap on it. Oh, promise, I'm not a buzz one of us alone. Now, man, you Satan. The devil is a liar. The devil is a liar. This is of what Lang Amanda Manch. We're going to invade with more power. Are we ruling? Just stretch yourself. Oh, come and just jump and let us see. So, also, Galapa, also, Lapana, Obozi, Zwaranjan. So, moving from the back, what were you feeling? I was tired. I thought I wasn't going to live. It was very hard. It's one of my spiritual sons. He's one of my spiritual sons. That listens. That does. Everything. He's so passionate about God. So zealous about Him. I've never seen a son like this. We would do some uh, services on Thursday. He'll sit down. He'll keep quiet and listen. And he'll come and he'll say, Dad, I love you. You just don't know how much I love you. Just don't know how much I love you. As a please pray for me. I want to live everything that you say. I want to do everything that you say. And you will go. And you will go and preach. Changing people's lives. And transform people's lives. One of powerful people. One of the sons that I'm very proud of that you don't know about. Who are shaking um slab? Your muzzles have on it when they go good man. When they go good man, when they go good man, just stand with me. And you'll just say, Stand with me. And everything that he does. I'm proud of you, my son. Joba technician, there were so many servants of God who have been discouraged. Joba technician, there were so many servants of God who have been discouraged. Joba technician, there were so many servants of God who have been discouraged. Joba technician, there were so many servants of God who have been discouraged. Joba technician, there were so many servants of God who have been discouraged. You are going to see this testimony. But you're going to see this. You testimony. are going to see this reality. People's lives are going to change. Not because, 
Not because I want to be revealed and I'm the God who says things, but it's because He's the one who says things. Today it happened. Before you, you saw Him shaking in front of you. And you saw Him being freed before you. I didn't even free Him. But His fellow colleague freed Him. Please bring you are losing out to the because you are speaking and you will not get your blessings. You will hear. They're afraid to even touch the name of certain songs. But the way that you speak about pastors, you forget that you are blessed through them. But let me leave you be. Because you are respectful. How are you feeling now? This is one John Manja. This one you're right. I feel good. Are you ready to go back? Yes. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Who told me they called me? Or go to Oko? Toby called me to bring him a bag. And I told him to bring him a bag. Because I'm rushing through him. And I said, nothing will defeat me in Jesus' name. Because I hadn't in my heart that something is going to happen. I'm going to come in and say, you see that word, Kolula? I'm still going to come in and say, Kolula, 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 I think even Pastor Mieza is amazed that when she speaks, something just happens. That's where you'll see. Is it going to be the same thing? How easy, easy really is. You're free, man. Congratulations, my son. May God bless you. What do you want to say before we get there? What do you want to say before I release you? I just want to thank you. I'm just thankful. Okay. Thank you so much. Oh, thank you. 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 Thank Thank you. 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 you. Thank 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 you. And that's how it ended. Then um Nasan Abon Guti I covering Yako I Hamba Nam no Mige Blanki Kon. Then I saw that your covering goes with me wherever I go. Because listening to when Gugama video I call you watching your videos on YouTube these past few days. And there was a spirit and I took my phone and threw it away. And then I saw that spirits can be overpowered by your covering. And many people say that that is your father. I don't know your... how many men of God manja say she. I don't know how many men of God have said this. So I need to follow you. But I need to follow you. And I saw that I need to follow you, and I need to be intentional in doing so. And I saw that I need to follow you, and I need to be intentional in doing so. And I need to be intentional in doing so. And I need to be intentional in doing so. And I need to be intentional in doing so. And I need to be intentional in doing so. And I need to be intentional in doing so. And I need to be intentional in doing so. And I need to be intentional in doing so. And I need to be intentional in doing so. And I need to be intentional in doing so. And I need to be intentional in doing so. And I need to be intentional in doing so. And I need to be intentional in doing so. And I need to be intentional in doing so. And I need to be intentional in doing so. And I need to be intentional in doing so. And I need to be intentional in doing so. And I need to be intentional and it belongs to the nations. And the world was to see. I'm so thankful. Just to know you in my life. Because these demons wanted to make me go insane. They'll come and they'll tell me. We don't want people who are like you. That help people. Because I'm always thinking about other people. That people always say that I forget myself. I love I love to help people. I love to preach the word of and God. And I love to preach the word of God. It's what you've taught us here. You've taught us love. That we should pray for people. Give them love and hug them. And give them money and food. And I've been doing that. And that's exactly what I'm doing. As you've told us. 
Gabonga wakulu kwazi. I'm just very grateful to know you. In my life. No mo baba me good for my life but I have a father. Even though my father is not in my life, I have a father. Gatanda kakulu. I love you very much, love Dad. Neno mama. As well as mom. Amen. Congratulations. I love you too, my son. Thank you. Thank you. Wow, my shell is answering. How does that feel? How does it feel to heal someone and then be healed? I don't know how to explain it. I hear these words that Jesus is speaking. If you can do it. Saying that Yeah, because sometimes we can't go to the house and go to the house and go to the house and go to the house. And it's only dad that can do deliverance. Even when you're away, there's that thing that says, I can't do it. God has given me a testimony that I can do it. That he's given me Amen. the strength. In challenge. That's how it is. Okay. Okay.